Welcome back guys, number 11th ranked Baylor, 5-0 undefeated take on Kansas State 4-2 and, and if you don't know or you forgot, Kevin Schur is the head coach for Kansas State. He was head coach for the Jaguars, No Walker was his offensive coordinator, they were butting heads but the two will finally meet offensive coordinator versus his previous head coach and Baylor is hot, they are on fire, they are first in the Big 12 and the divisions Big 12 South, Baylor is first 5-0, Oklahoma second, and Marshall is ranked first in the Big 12 North. They are on a four game win streak after starting out 0-2. They took down Oklahoma and Texas. And the Jaguars, just an update, unfortunately are doing very bad, 0-5, and, and five straight losses. I mean, they're just, they're struggling since Noah Walker has moved on. But it is time for a reunion, guys. It's another game. Welcome back again. It's another week of football. It's exciting. Baylor is on the road to take on Kansas State. Baylor is favored to win this, but Kansas State is not struggling. They are 4 and 2. They're looking for their fifth win. And rushing offense for Baylor has just been unstoppable. As we know, Shocklinwood has just command takes command of this offense. His run game, his ability to Fine holes and just burst for like huge gains is just unmatched so far and he is just going crazy and it's he is the anchor for this offense and here it is first down starting the game and there is Linwood getting the first handoff and it is just short of the first down third and two David Downs also having a good season he is leading this Baylor offense and there's Linwood right up the middle for 10 yards getting the first down First and 10, they are almost at midfield, and David Downs is going to keep in. He's shown that he is a good runner, picking up nine yards, third and inches, and not to mention this Baylor offensive line is just great. Devin Chaffin getting the first down. Third and three, let's see if they convert this. Downs is going to run out, and it just hits the turf. No one gets that, but they're going to go for it on fourth down. Fourth and three, here's David Downs, and he can't get it off. It's gonna be a turnover on Downs. That's a huge sack, and Kansas State gets good field position around midfield, still in their own territory. First and 10, and breaks free from a tackle and a few there. Kevin West getting the first down. Second and five, Baylor's defense has been strong. Let's see if they can keep it going, and he gets the first down, Daniel Sams. Third and ten, let's see if this defense can make a stand. It's a screen pass, and they do tackle the running back. Leverett gets taken down. Fourth and 14, they're going to go for three here to get first on the board, and that's more than enough. They do get it, and they're on the board first. Now for a studio update. Tennessee has taken down South Carolina, number fifth ranked South Carolina. There it goes, one upset. And the Gamecocks are no longer undefeated. And another upset against Ohio State. Oregon State takes them down. It's two upsets already. Let's see if Kansas State can pull this one through. And there's Linwood with the big run. Getting the first down. He's a speedy running back. First and 10. And Downs is going to keep it. And he does get the first down. He's still on his feet. That's a big run by David Downs, 33 yards, and Noel Walker is keeping it on the ground so far. And here's Linwood, it's the blocking he needs, and he's in the open, he's in the end zone for another touchdown. Add that to his total, 103 for the day for Baylor so far, and their first touchdown is on the ground for today. 7-3, to three, third and 10, to see if Baylor can get a stop, and he throws it out of bounds. And defense makes a stop there. Three and out, first and ten. Five wide outside. David Downs getting the protection he needs. And he connects with Corey Coleman for eight yards. Third and two. Still in the first quarter. And there is Linwood. He's running into his own lineman. Defense is there. They do their job. And they can't get the first down. And Baylor will go for it again. And it hits the turf. David Downs' accuracy is off today. That's going to be another Turnover on down to second for today, giving Kansas State good field position. And Sams keeps it. He runs for a first down. First and ten. And he's brought down for a sack. 
Third and 15 this is going to be very difficult for them to convert. Let's see what they do here. The protection throwing it deep down the field and it hits the turf. No one gets that completely out in the open. No one was even around that area. First and 10, David Downs. He breaks a tackle, still on his feet. He pitches it off to Linwood. And Linwood is pushed out of bounds. 26 yards. There's huge chunks of yardage. Third and four. And he gets it. Stewart gets the first down. Dusty Stewart. And that's going to end the first quarter. It's close so far. 7-3 to three in Baylor so far. They are in control. Still a close score though. David Downs. Accuracy needs some work. Third and seven. He's going to use his arm. And he throws it deep down the field to Corey Coleman. He's in the end zone for a 40-yard touchdown. David Downs once again connecting with Corey Coleman deep down the field. And Marshall ranked 22nd. Four straight wins. And they are tied with UCF starting the second quarter. UCF 1-4. Their first season as well in the Big 12 they're struggling. Marshall is doing well. And Sam's hits the ground. The ball hits the ground. He can't get the first down. So the newcomers, UCF and Marshall, battling it out. But we'll come back to that. David Downs is going to keep it on the option. He's still on his feet. Another big gain. 14 yards on the ground. Third and seven. David Downs under center. Drops back. Good protection. And nearly picked off. The linebacker and the safety were there. Luckily for Downs, it was deflected. And they're going to go for three. And they do get it. And like I said, back to studio update. UCF and Marshall still tied halfway through the second quarter. All right, back to this game. Kansas State with the ball. They're down 14, and Sam's going to keep it. Breaks free from the first sack, but they bring him down eventually. So another sack for this Baylor defense. Third and 10, and it's going to be a screen pass, and that's going to be a two-yard loss. They can't convert. And we are midway through the second quarter, and Baylor 151 in the first, 61 in the second. Defense allowing zero for Kansas State in the second quarter so far. Defense is dominant right now. Second and 11. He connects with Robbie Rhodes. And that's a big game. He's still running. They haven't taken him down. They get him down around the 21. 35 yards. They're just explosive plays after explosive plays today. First and 10. Here is David Downs on the play action. And he connects with Gus Penny. He's in the end zone. The tight end gets a 22-yard touchdown reception. The second for David Downs. And they are adding to their lead so far Kansas State with the ball three and a half minutes to go in the second quarter and Sam's on the option but he's tackled immediately that's a four yard loss second and four here's Sam's again and he connects with his receiver there's Vaughn getting the first down third and seven let's see if this Bears defense can stop them and they do they catch him immediately Burton can't get it done. That's going to bring on fourth down, and they're going to punt this. Oh, and it's a fake. Do they get it? They do get it. Gronkowski, Glenn Gronkowski, another Gronk, gets the job done, gets the first down. But here is third and four again. It's a screen pass. They're going to get him. They do bring him down. He doesn't get this one. It's a four-yard loss. Someone is injured. That is Leverett's. Update, up, update on him later. Here is first and ten. David Downs connecting with Shocklin Wood, breaking free from a tackle to get the first down. 41 seconds. They want to get on the board to get a bigger lead. First and ten. Noah Walker is enjoying this and is intercepted by Williams. He was right there, hit out of David Downs' arm. I spoke too soon, and the turnover gets Kansas State on the board. That's going to give some energy to this Kansas State defense. Third and ten. Here's David Downs again. And it's picked off by Burns. Another turnover for Kansas State. He breaks a tackle. Is he in the end zone? Yes, he is. Oh, my God. I can't believe this is happening. Kansas State, just like that, they make this an eight-point game. And it's a seven-point game after the extra points. Kansas State... Even though they're behind, go into the half with the momentum 
the Bears just completely collapsed in that final minute of the second quarter. Oh my god, that was just unbelievable. David Downs both just two turnovers. One he tried to pitch it or, or it got hit out of his hand as he was trying to throw it. And Kansas State took advantage. Both returned. And I would say they're both pick sixes. And Baylor, they were hot. And they have to just continue off what they're going. And this Kansas State defense has revived this team. They're going to try to go back to the drawing board, see what they can do. But just look at the stats. 35 passing, 19 rushing. I mean, this offense hasn't done anything against Baylor. But you can see the two turnovers are what cost Baylor. 126 passing, 160 on the ground. They just have to keep working towards the strengths, and they can win this one. But we'll see. Let's get back to the game, guys. 54 yards allowed. Kansas State will get the ball first. Two sacks for this Baylor defense. Second and 10. Here is Sams, and he completes the pass. Breaks three tackles. That's Devin Craig breaks three tackles, gets the first down. Third and eight, it's a screen pass, but they don't get this one. It's a five-yard loss. Charles Jones coming in for Leverett. They can't get the first down. Let's see if Baylor can make up for what they lost there. Here's David Downs keeping it on the ground. Stiff arms the defender, and there is a face mask. They bring him down. That's going to move them up, and the country is starting to realize how hard it is to take down David Downs. He's a powerful runner. First and 10. He's not a dual threat, but he can definitely use his legs when he needs to. And here is an option. It's a big run by David Downs. He's brought down around the 20. First and 10. Got the fullback in motion. Here's Linwood working around the corner. Stiff arms the defender enough to get 11 yards and the first down and so far he has 116 yards On the ground David Downs and he connects with Jay Lee for another Baylor Bears touchdown and they build on their lead Three touchdowns for David Downs studio update back to the UCF game and the Marshall Marshall is down three points And they're still early in the th third quarter a lot of football still left, but this one is going back and forth Got six minutes left in the third. Kansas State's going to try to get something going first and ten. It's a screen pass to his receiver. And Kyle Klein gets the first down. Second and ten. Here is Daniel Sams again. And it's a screen pass. This one works in their favor. Finally, they get the first down. 11 yards. They are in Bears, Bears territory. And there's Daniel Sams. It's a big run. He's still on his feet. He's finally brought down after 28 yards. Third and nine, and it's nearly picked off on third down there. Luckily for Daniel Sam, that just hits the ground. Fourth and nine, it's better if they go for three here and make it an 11 point game. They do get it. 31 to 20 is closer than it looks. Midway through the third quarter, here's David Downs. He's gonna keep it on the option so far. He's gonna pitch it off to Devin Chaffin. They get the first down there. Third and ten. The ground game is working for them. Here is the pass. And he passes to Lynx Hawthorne. It's the first time we're hearing that name. And it's first and ten. Here's David Downs. And he connects with Jay Lee. Got a touchdown earlier. And they're working their way up the field pretty easily. But another third down. It is a screen pass to Shock Linwood. He's going to try to get. No, he gets tipped up from behind. Picking up six yards. Defender caught him just diving there. And they're going to go for three. And they, they make this a two-score game. 14 points. Baylor 34 points, 53 plays, 391 total yards. Kansas State 131. You would think this would be a blowout so far, but it's still close. Here is Sam throwing deep down the field. And he connects with his receiver wide open. No one around him. The play action worked in their favor and Burton gets a huge touchdown. And they make this a one score game, 34 to 27, an upset could happen, ladies and gentlemen. Here's Linwood, and he just stutter steps there enough to get the first down, 10 yard gain. It looks like, it feels like he's just picking up chunks of 10 yards at a time. Here's David Downs, finally brought down after eight yards and a first down, they are in Kansas State territory. Here's Linwood again. And just trucks a defender. 14 yards there for Linwood. The powerful runner despite his size. And here he is again. 
That's 10 yards. And we are going into the fourth quarter. It's a one score game, ladies and gentlemen. Those two turnovers at the end of the second quarter has given Kansas State a spark. And they are still in this game. In eight minutes, we will decide a winner. And he pitches it off to Linwood. He's going to get in the end zone. And he gets tackled. 283 yards on the ground for Baylor today. And there's Devin Chaffin. He's in the end zone for a Baylor Bears touchdown. 40 plus points. 41 to 27. Again, a two score game. And there is the running back. Charles Jones, 15 yards. Nearing midfield, here's Sams, and he connects with his receiver. That's another first down for Kansas State. Here's Sams, and another first down on third and one. He got that he got that out of his hand pretty quickly. Third and six, let's see if Baylor can hold it down. And they bring Sams down for a big sack, fourth and 13. Let's see what Kansas State does. They will go for it. Fourth and 13, let's see what happens here. The fans are on the edge of their seats. He throws it down the field, he connects, and he's in the end zone. That is Leandro Gordon in the end zone. Two touchdowns for Samson. They bring this within one score. Once again, Marshall, 10 minutes, 35 seconds. They are down five points, 33 to 28. UCF looking for their second win in the Big 12. Here is second and seven. Here's David Downs up the middle. He's still going on his feet, picking up the first down. Second and one. Kansas State's defense got to do something if they want to have a chance to win this because Baylor's offense has been unstoppable in the second half. Third and four, a little over two minutes left to go. And there he is connecting with Corey Coleman. And Kansas State down to one timeout. Kevin Schur wants to win this game. Eagles are at stake. And if he gets this first down, which he does, that's going to end the game effectively. And Baylor wins this. Kevin Schur is handed a loss from his former offensive coordinator, putting up 41 points on him. Despite that, Sams did have a really good game. 253 yards, two touchdowns. Nearly gave the Cats a win. And that's 23 carries, 185 yards player of the game. Shock Linwood clearly again was unstoppable. Only 185 yards passing by Baylor, but three touchdowns from David Downs. 347 on the ground, 185 from Linwood. David Downs, 44% completion rate. He's got to do a better job on, on that. He was inaccurate today, and but he was good on the ground. 10 attempts, 104 yards. And the ball, of course, passing as usual was spread around Corey Coleman. Lee and Penning getting a touchdown each. After a nice win against his former coach, Noah Walker and the Bears are back at home to take on Oklahoma State. Stay tuned guys.